Pittsburgh State gets a warm welcome back into the playoffs with the home advantage over six seed Harding. A one loss team with some striking similarities to MIAA foe Missouri Southern. And that's actually made this week's practice a bit easier for the Gorillas as they are using the same exact game plan they used against the Lions in week nine. You watch them on video and again their style is a lot like Missouri Southern offensively. Uh, but you don't know how good the competition is or or how bad it could be or whatever. They'll run all the triple option stuff and then they find ways to scheme it. If it's not working, they will uh, adjust blocking schemes and they do a really nice job of, of doing that. We retained a lot of that information that we learned in Missouri Southern and I feel like we'll be able to play it better than what we did at Missouri Southern. It's a big time football game. Um, it's kind of a do or die situation and um, we got to go in with kind of our backs against the wall and that, uh, you know, we're fighting for more playoff games. We begin with the end in mind. That's been our logo all, all of the time. And I think our end has always been the national championship. Um, so it's still the pressure to get there. Uh, but we still have to take it one game at a time. And Harding is our next opponent. The Bison rushing attack ranks second in all of Division II, but the Gorillas are confident that the rest of the MIAA has prepared them for Saturday's game. The Gorillas actually rank second in the conference in points given up per game. Also expect to see more of Tyler Disney in the rotation at linebacker. Coach Tim Beck told me earlier today that he's practiced very well this week and his presence will only fuel the defense that much more. At Carney Smith, Celie Godwin, Action 12 Sports.